Welcome to the next stage of um, me setting up my tank. As you can see from the last stage, the immersion is all in now. Um, it's all tested. I left it 48 hours fill up with water. As you can see, I filled it up from there. I put all these on just temporary. That could be drained down, so everything's fine. Now, I was going to buy a tank frame, and they're a good couple of hundred quid. So I thought to myself, you know, I've got a load of fiberglass left. I've got some wood left over from a little summer house I built. So what I've done is I've put wood all the way around the outside, if you can see, right around the back. That's screwed at the moment. Later on I'm just going to pop down the builder's merch and get a couple of bolts. So it's going to be fixed to the back of the, uh, the bottom of my van. Because um, I've got some fiberglass left, I'm then going to put fiberglass upstands all the way around the back, which will help strengthen it and also keep it waterproof. Um, I'll show you that later. Right, as you can see, I've got a fiberglass all the way around now. I've bolted it to the bottom. On top of the fiberglass, I've then put another 2x2, two two, which I'm going to build my framework to. Um, later on, I'm going to get some hardener and some grey resin, and I'll paint that all the way around to match in with the rest of, um, rest of the floor. What I've also done as an added protection, these are builder's bands. They're all the way around the outside and right around there and I've also fixed them to the bottom and I've got a plate the other side in the cab which is then screwed in so you've got four screws in through there and screwed to the bottom this is absolutely solid now and I still haven't finished ready to the next stage That's my final stage. Everything ready now for pump control and bits and pieces to go on. Um, I've left space down there for my DI vessel. Uh, you might have thought everything's gone a bit over the top, but um, you know, I'd have had to buy shelves and make them. This is all built now to exactly what I want to the sizes I need. Um, I've also put now a restraining strap on around the side, all the way around there, around there. So I mean, there's just no way this is going to move. It's got three bands around there. It's fiberglassed in at the bottom. Um, safety is very important. So as we go along, you can see I've shelved all along the top there. I've used thicker wood here. because This is where I'm going to have my leisure battery, just on top. Um, this is where I'll put all boxes, put all my bits and pieces on, like scrims and you know, washing up liquid and Vice versa. <coughs> so my battery's going to go along the front. Just got a bit of ply. I uh, got it on eBay. I think it looks quite smart. It cost me four pound fifty, including postage. It's a vinyl sheet. Um, just thought that looks quite good. Um, and that's it. All finished. Now I've just got to make my holes for my immersion um, and connect to my pump and everything. That's uh, my next stage. Right. Thanks for looking.